running a little below normal at 81 degrees. I think tomorrow we may not even make it to 80. Stay in the upper 70s in most areas. The normal high, though, is getting lower as we move our way into September. Now these normals will continue to trend downward. The typical low today is 63 degrees. About a tenth of an inch of rain at the airport today and a little more downtown Baltimore, just over a third of an inch at the Maryland Science Center near the Inner Harbor. There are still a few scattered showers, but they're now mostly south of Baltimore, moving down towards southern Maryland or across parts of Montgomery County, and they'll continue to push farther away as high pressure settles in from the north and west with that comfortably cool late summer air for Friday. In fact, right through the weekend, temperatures will stay below normal, and the front that triggered today's showers, now that it's south of us, it'll be a main steering mechanism for Hermine, the hurricane that's going to make landfall in the Florida Panhandle tonight. As it tracks to the north, it'll encounter the front and get pushed out to sea instead of making its way farther up the eastern seaboard. It's a category one storm right now. Winds at the center of the storm are estimated at 75 miles an hour. You got to be 74 mile an hour winds to become a hurricane. So just barely a hurricane gust though over over 80 miles an hour, and it is expected to make landfall here with a decent storm surge. So they're kind of worried about the flooding along the coast and also from the heavy rains that are already spiraling around the center of the storm. General track takes it up the eastern seaboard and we will see it make its approach here on Saturday. Tomorrow should be a beautiful day with mostly sunny skies, but notice the storm coming up across the coastal areas of North Carolina east of Virginia Beach by Saturday afternoon, pounding Ocean City with heavy rain and gusty winds and then moving farther out to sea, but still the back edge of it producing some showers along the coastal areas right on into Sunday. At Ocean City, winds could gust over 50 miles an hour Saturday afternoon, Saturday night, and they could pick up three to five inches of rain there depending on the exact track of the storm. So windy and wet at the beach. The farther west you go, the better the weather the weekend will be. Clearing skies tonight in Baltimore, then sunny skies tomorrow. Highs of 77 to 82. It'll be breezy on the bay for the next few days, so be careful if you're out there. Small craft advisory as the winds gust to 20 knots tomorrow, maybe a little stronger on the bay Saturday and Sunday. 60s for highs in the mountains with some sunshine. Beautiful mountain weather for the Labor Day weekend. Eastern shore, while well, you get closer to the storm on the coast and the rain shower chances increase, especially Saturday into Sunday. Beach, well, it looks kind of nice tomorrow, but windy and wet. Saturday and Sunday. Seven day forecast for Baltimore 79 tomorrow, upper 70s Saturday, Sunday, just a 30 to 40% chance of an occasional shower here and then partly cloudy on Labor Day Monday.